Welcome back to the Rayford Collins Golden Gloves Arena. I'm Mike Doles. Matches tonight being brought to you by Jackson Energy Authority. And I've got another boxer with me. What's your name? Lance Braden. All right. Lance, where are you from? Ripley, Tennessee. Ripley, Tennessee. Have you been boxing a long time? Or? About a year. About a year. What kind of fight record do you have so far? One. Because you've had one fight or you just won all of them that you fought? No, I've had one fight. Okay. Did you win it? No. Uh, you're going to make up for that tonight, though, right? Yes, sir. All right. What made you want to get into boxing? I mean, you're a young guy. You could be doing a lot of different things. Did you have a certain fighter that you saw fight and maybe you want to fashion yourself after that? Yes, sir. Okay. Who would that be? Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali. That's got to be one of the best out there for sure. Well, good luck in tonight's fight, okay? Yes, sir. Welcome back to the Golden Glove Arena and Jackson Boxing Club with action being brought to you by the Jackson Energy Authority. One thing you can count on, getting set for action in the ring between William Curvin out of Red Bank, Tennessee, and Lance Braden out of Ripley, Tennessee. 115-pound weight class, but going to be the one-minute rounds. We'll have three one-minute rounds between Curvin out of Red Bank and Braden out of Ripley. Referee in charge of the action in the center of the ring, Ray Robertson. Very quickly, Braden comes out, firing on all cylinders. Curvin just trying to back him up and block shots. Constant barrage of shots there by Braden. Braden with the blue gloves out of the blue corner. Constant shots. Docks a, ducks a shot or two, and now we're going to have the referee telling him to keep the shots up. Well, Brayton, like I said, just come out firing. Well, I tell you what, Kirvin's got all he can handle with constant barrage of shots from Lance Braden. Braden has thrown so many punches in this first round here that Kirvin hadn't really had a chance to even throw one. He's just on the constant defense. He was constantly trying to keep the shots from hitting his head. And you get a shot of Kirvin in the corner, he's already got a swelled up upper lip it looks like because he was taking some serious shots from Lance Braden out of Ripley. There's the uh, shot of Curvin there in the corner. And already that lip swelled up and basically a untouched Lance Braden. Shots there as you watch Braden just constantly throwing shots. Curvin tried to come back in with a couple, but every time he moved in, he gets tagged. There's that left-right, left combination. We get set for round number two here at the Golden Gloves Arena. And the action being brought to you by Jackson Energy Authority. And back into the action, and very quickly again, Braden comes out swinging. Let's see if Curvin can find a way to... Stop that barrage of shots coming from Braden. Couple of good shots there get in from Curvin. There's one left right. And now Braden kind of winded. Curvin's opportunity to get some shots in there. There he steps into a shot, Curvin does. But Braden comes back firing again. Braden been lighting up the face of William Curvin. Once again, now Braden a little winded, slows down the power of the shots a little bit. But it's taken a toll on Curvin. Curvin's arms are even red from the shots that were missing. If you look at the uh, left and right arms of Curvin, they're already very red. Look at this. See the, see the shot of them there, the redness of the arms of Curvin when he was trying to block those shots from Braden coming in. So that takes a toll on you, too, if you're trying to 
throw shots and you're constantly taking shots to the arm. Even when Kerbin was stepping in trying to throw a shot, he was catching those shots. And there's where the referee stopped that one as the bell rang. Brayton, and there's Kerbin again. You can see the redness and swelling of the arms. When Brayton, when that bell rings, Brayton comes out firing with everything he's got for the first 20, 30 seconds or so. The referee gets everybody settled. And here we go for the third and final round. And Will Kervin got a shot in that time very quickly, and that's what he's going to have to do because Brayton is throwing everything he's got, plus the kitchen sink back at Kervin. Kervin tries to step in for a shot, but by the time he does, he's taking three or four from Brayton. Braden over the top shot again, catches the face. Kervin just straight shots, jabs back and forth, left, right, left, right, but Braden able to put a shot to the head of Kervin there. Another big right hand by Braden. Kervin keeps coming forward, though, and a good straight shot in on to Braden's face from Kervin. And this one comes to an end. And, boy, I tell you what, just constant power shots from Lance Braden. Kervin trying his best just to hang in there. He took some serious shots from Braden all the way through that one. Kervin was also able to land some on to Braden. But Braden was just nonstop. We'll see what the judges' scorecards reflect. But probably going to be a clear victory for Lance Braden out of Ripley, Tennessee. Kervin again out of Red Bank. As we get the headgear removed from Kervin over in the red corner. The face of uh, Braden's a little red, too, as he was catching some shots from Kervin. Just don't know if it was too little too late for Kervin to pick up that victory. And once again, Kervin comes over to thank Braden. Here's a replay of some of those shots. There's that straight jab, but every time Kervin comes in with a jab, he catches that, which is a left-right combination from Braden. And getting sent to find out the Victor of this match. As we get the votes tallied and handed in to the corner, and here it is. And the winner, like we thought, Lance Braden out of Ripley, Tennessee, picks up the victory over William Curvin. Fighters hug each other and say good fight, as it always is here at the Golden Gloves Arena. Action again brought to you by Jackson Energy Authority. One thing you can count on.